hey everyone welcome back to the video i hope you all are doing great and i also hope that you guys have watched the previous videos of uh, integrating spotify into our virtual assistant jarvis uh, integrating uh, um, the song feature um, and uh, date time time uh, time feature and many other features which we integrated uh, in today's video as the title says as the thumbnail says we are going to integrate uh, Microsoft Excel and Microsoft PowerPoint so people who don't know what this Microsoft Excel and PowerPoint is it's a software from Microsoft uh, Excel is used for storing of data uh, visualization uh, reports uh, many other uh, things like storing it's a database management or it mainly they can say for database management uh, many firms use it for collecting data uh, many other things like reports are done visualizations like patterns like bar chart uh, all these things are done and powerpoint obviously it's used for presentations it is used highly for presentations uh, for school teachers students many other uh, many people use uh, powerpoint uh, for presentation so these two softwares are from microsoft so that we will be integrating in today's video uh, in our jarvis so with the help of jarvis we'll be able to open uh, microsoft excel and powerpoint so people who already knew it uh, well good and uh, let's not waste much more uh, let's not waste uh, too much time and get straight into the video so guys right now i am in my uh pie charm right here um and if you see we have done the code for spotify song feature uh, time function uh the date function and before that we have added added all the necessary required uh neuron uh, new neural languages uh neurons which are required for such as uh import files all those things which are important for the virtual assistant jarvis right so now we will be integrating uh, our excel so excel and powerpoint so let's just you know put a type or a text feature right here so let's put it as um, opening um, excel uh, and powerpoint powerpoint okay okay just a second let me just uh, check my keyboard yeah let's just put ppt it would be better opening uh, excel and ppt that would be better and let's bring it back to the loop uh, let's put f lf uh, open excel we are, we, are, we are creating the first uh, natural language for our virtual assistant jarvis so let's put open excel yeah open excel in self dot query uh, let's make another um, natural language uh, we can put open excel sheet that could be better excel sheet yeah oh there's a little bit correction we need to do right here um let's yeah it's fine i believe yeah um and self self dot query yeah and we can also add another uh, natural language we can put uh, could you open uh, excel yeah that could be better in self dot query correct so if you people are wondering um, about this excel sheet how to uh, what are the things we can do so don't worry i'll be bringing a separate video on uh, excel uh, as i promised i'm gonna bring a video on uh, uh, stock market uh, prediction part two stock about stock market where i'll be talking about excel itself the data where we're going to store the data we're going to visualize it we're going to use csv file or uh, we can use excel or csv file both together uh, all these things I'll be letting you know with the help of data frame, with the help of pandas package, with the help of matplotlib, we can uh, visualize the data what we put uh, in the stock or the stock market. Uh, many other things what we can do. So definitely I can bring a new video uh, on that, a uh, separate video on that, so that you guys can get to know it better, right? So now we have put open Excel, open Excel sheet. Uh, could you open Excel? 
uh, and self dot query for our Jarvis. Now what we can do is we can put a speak function right here. What we can tell is opening. Yeah. So we can tell Jarvis to tell opening and dots. Yeah. Now once this is done, we are going to use a package called as start file. Fine. Uh, so if you people know about this uh, package, you will be uh, if you uh, it will be better. But uh, people have watched my basic virtual assistant. Uh, I've used this file more, so they'll be knowing it better. So this start file is from the import uh, where we imported OS from OS import start file. So this is a package which we had imported. So now we are gonna give a part uh, to our start file. So in order to do that, what we will do is we will uh, open uh, just a second. I will create the text right here. Fine. Uh, in capital. Yeah. Opening. OK, for that, we need to create a path. So in order to create the path, you need to open the file manager right here. Or instead of using the file manager, what we can do is we can come to the search console right here and type in excel and you will get this option you'll get this uh, prompt which is open and you can click on open file location once you click on open file location you will find many uh, softwares or applications or uh, softwares basically start start uh, starting startup uh, softwares that are in your windows uh, for example there's msx access powerpoint and microsoft edge chrome many other things right here uh, ms access is also one more uh, database management system we can integrate this also in the next uh, videos if you want i can do a separate video on that also so we'll do about that in the next um, video so now we'll do about our excel so right click on excel and you will find many options right here you can click on properties once you click on properties you'll find this part target okay click uh, you need not click you can just control c copy that fine close this we don't require this we'll minimize this because we need that one more time uh, and paste it now for, uh, people who know this before like if they've seen the basic virtual assistant they'll be knowing about this why i'm adding the slash right here uh, because in that videos in that series we had got error 404 error so this uh, slash is main important so make sure you put the slashes uh, properly so that um, there'll be no error that is given to you so here we have integrated our excel right now we'll be integrating our uh, powerpoint so what we can do is we can copy this and come to the path right here and paste it and instead of excel we can just put open powerpoint yeah open powerpoint uh, open powerpoint um, in self dot query open uh, instead of open excel shield we can just keep open ppt that could be better and could you open powerpoint that could be even more better powerpoint so could you i think that should be better yeah could you open powerpoint uh, and here also could you i forgot about that really sorry apologize for that could you open powerpoint uh, and could you open excel uh, in self dot query fine as the same opening is the same and then now we need to change the path we can't keep the excel path what we need to do is the same thing uh, either you can come to the search uh, you can put powerpoint uh, it will come open file location or right click and you will get open file location any of that uh, for me it's already open right here so i'll just come right here and i'll i can get it right here uh, and we're having other applications or softwares right here if you can see uh, not application actually it's softwares i'm telling uh, application application again so really sorry for that uh, so we're having pc health so health checkup right health, uh, health check so we are going to bring this uh, health check in the next videos upcoming videos where we'll be integrating uh, pc health check uh, and uh, maybe you know quick heal uh, we are going to integrate where we are going to uh, use our virtual assistant jarvis to open and maybe use that to you know open and do some functions with that so where our pc is completely secure 
where our Jarvis itself is able to do those tasks. So we'll right click again the same thing, copy the path. Once you copied, close the uh, window, uh, come back to this, paste it right here. Uh, and what you can do is put the slash. What I will do is I'll remove this uh, extra inverted comma right here and put those slash right here. So we can put one more right here and one more right here. Yeah. So here we have integrated our PowerPoint, our Excel, both of them. Uh, in the next video, we'll be integrating um, Instagram, Facebook. But before that, uh, we, are, we may integrate uh, PC Health Checkup, where we are going to integrate Quick Heal, uh, or maybe uh, other features. Who you never know. Uh, it could be any. We'll just jumble it. So it'll be better if we do something like Instagram or Facebook, where uh, our virtual assistant is able to enable that. Um, and more into that so many other features so i'll be letting you know about that so stay tuned for that and that's it for today's video guys i hope you liked it um the source code link and all will be there in the description um you guys can check out the description all the links of the videos everything will be there in the description um before checking the link make sure to check out the video on how to access the source code uh, it will be easier for you to access it and you know copy and paste it make your job easier only thing is you need to change the path right here i think that could be done easily so that's it for today's video guys i hope you guys liked it uh do subscribe to the channel if you have already subscribed thank you if you have not uh, subscribed do consider subscribing and uh, till then stay tuned take care have a great day happy coding and peace out guys bye